Okay. What's good with y'all? You did what I'm saying? Just tell me what's good with y'all. Just put it in the comments what's good, you know what I'm saying? Peace, love, and prosperity, everybody. It's your boy, Najee Ra. You did what I'm saying? And basically, I came on here to do a short video. I, I want it to be short, but I don't know if it's going to be short. But uh, this is the message I got from the, uh, uh, the Most High. And I, I just basically came on here to tell you guys, free your mind. Free your mind. It's that simple. And you probably asking me, how, how do I free my mind? Okay, first, stop eating that bullshit ass meat. Because at this time, at this day and age, I don't know what the fuck is real and what is not. If you ever seen the movie The Matrix, you it's a dude named Apoc. I think that's his name, Apoc. He was talking to Agent Smith and he was eating a steak. He said, I know this steak isn't real, but I'm going to eat it anyway. So it's like... What the fuck is real? What the fuck ain't real? Because you know they're making GMO every fucking thing. They're trying to make GMO meat. They're trying to make indoor farms. Like, bro, it's already happening. And y'all don't see it. And I see the bigger picture. That's number one. And all of this shit, all of this shit is out of order. It just coming off my head. Um, What else? Get off of social media. Get off of social media. Please, I'm asking y'all. Like, I'm not begging because I ain't no begging type. Y'all do what the fuck I want to do. I don't give a fuck. But y'all asking me how the fuck to free your mind and shit like that. And I'm telling your ass to get off of social media and y'all look at me stupid. Like me, I don't know what the fuck is going on, bro. I literally don't know what the fuck is going on. I get all my information from within. So with that being said, like I asked the all high, the most high for all uh, information. And they send me places to get the information. But it's up to me to decode whatever they sent me. You dig what I'm saying? Even if it be a YouTube video or if it be like if I'm posting something on YouTube and I see a YouTube video, if I post something on Facebook, Twitter, Snapchat, you know what I'm saying? And I see somebody else post like a positive post. It probably was a sign for me. But me personally, I don't get on social media until I post something because every time I get on social media, it either R.I.P., uh, a uh, uh, cop being a black dude is like it's trying to keep our vibration low. So I'm not feeding into that bullshit. No, no, no. So you have to get, you got to free your mind. You have to get off the of social media, bro, because the shit that they telling y'all is not important. Like this shit is not important, bro. They just some shit to make a uh, race war. You dig what I'm saying? And it's like y'all got to stop feeding into this bullshit, bro. It's like. Stop. Like, why? Why y'all giving y'all time and energy to these people? Like, keep your energy. Save your energy. And I was going to stop making YouTube videos because I feel like y'all wasn't paying me no attention. Y'all wasn't listening type shit. But I don't give a damn. But something in me was like, nah, I can't leave the ones who are really watching me got now out to dry like that. So I was like, ugh, yeah. So like, I got back in this shit. So I did my first video since a week. But, uh... I've been taking care of myself, man, meditating and all that. So I'm good. I ain't going nowhere. You did what I'm saying? I'm still here. But free your mind. Get off of social media, bro. Because now they pushing. When I did get on social media and now we're uploading shit on YouTube, watching YouTube videos, like, they keep putting the ads, bro. Like, the election. Like, that, that shit is the biggest distraction every four years, bro. I don't care, bro. That's the biggest distraction. To see what's really going on. And, and and another way to free your mind is to uh start watching the news, bro. Start watching fake media. All of this shit, like I said, all of this shit is fake, bro. Everything is fake. Everything you see with these two eyes are fake, bro. Like, you got to see the shit with your third eye. You got to see everything for what it is, bro. And like I said, I don't know what the fuck is real at this point. And I don't know what's fake. Because when we go to sleep and we have dreams... Who's to say that's the real world? You dig what I'm saying? That could be the real world. And we wake up back into this shit hole, hell hole right here. You dig what I'm saying? The 3D reality is like, damn, are we really sleep? Or are you woke? You dig what I'm saying? I don't fucking know. I don't know. And I'm getting chills all through my body because my vibration is rising because I don't, you know what I'm saying? I'm venting to y'all and y'all go pick it up. 
But um, uh, yeah, uh, meditate. That's another way. Meditating sun gaze. You have to meditate to uh in order to 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 raise your vibrations. That's another way to raise your vibration. Like you got to eat. You got to cut that bullshit meat out. Like I said before, you got to eat right, man, and and meditate in sun gaze. Sun gaze. It helps your pineal gland uncalcify from all that fucking fluoride and shit they've been putting in the fucking water and toothpaste and all this bullshit. So that'll, that'll help it. You know what I'm saying? That'll help you wake up, in a sense. Like, be aware. More conscious. And when you sun gazing, for like, do it for like 10 minutes for a week straight. You'll see everything for what it is. And you will actually see people auras, bro. Like, the energy feel. You know, like on Dragon Ball Z, how Goku went Super Saiyan 1. He had a little aura around him to go or you'll start seeing people aura like that. It'll be like, like the chakra system though. But um yeah, sun gaze, meditate. And meditate helps you with stress and anxiety, bro. Like that shit, that shit, bro, meditate. If you got depression, stress and anxiety, meditate. That shit'll help you. But I said all that to say this like they putting shit in the news that really don't matter. Because at the end of the day, China is fucked up. Everything, you got to think about this. Everything that made in the U.S., basically everything is made in China. You did what I'm saying? I say 90% of everything in the U.S. is made by China. But by me saying 90%, that's giving them a, 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 a little bit of, you know, leeway. They probably own more. But I think them folks were mad at Trump for making that deal, like, to cut China off. No fuck with man, cause China basically own us, nigga. But um, it's like China is flooded. China is underwater. We selling our food to China, and y'all niggas don't see that shit. I don't know how the fuck y'all don't see this shit, but I kind of know why y'all don't see this shit, cause y'all distracted. But uh, yeah, man, like this shit is crazy, bro. This shit is getting real, bro. It's, it's just October. October is almost fucking finished already. It's what day it is? October 14th. Yeah, October almost finished, bro. And we're going straight into November. November is finna be very, 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 very crazy. My nigga, when I'm from this little small rural town, bro, shit is getting so hectic, bro. Like, people getting shot left and right. So you gotta watch what you say to people. Cause people go pop off, my nigga. People go pop off. And that's why I'm finna get in, into astrology because billionaires study astrology. You did what I'm saying? And what I mean by that, they study the signs and the, the I mean, they study the stars and the planets and, and the energy, the planets and shit give off so they can know when to make their next move. You did what I'm saying? So I'm finna do that shit. You did. So once I understand that, oh, it, it's real. I ain't even saying I'm gonna be a billionaire. I'm gonna just know how to move. Like, you did what I'm saying? Like, that person, nah, I ain't fucking with that person. I can already feel people vibe. I can't necessarily see that aura yet, but I can sense a bad vibe. Like, oh, that person, oh, hell no. Nah. Mm -mm. You did what I'm saying? I can sense that shit. But, you know, I just keep it pushing. I don't let it bother me. I don't let negativity bother me. You did what I'm saying? I don't feed into the bullshit. I always kill negativity with positivity. You did what I'm saying? I always think positive so you can kick that negative shit out, bro. Because once you think positive, all you, would, all you would get is positive. You did what I'm saying? You're thinking negative. That's all you're going to get. That's why it's like hell on earth for most of, well, majority of the people. And it's that 1% that's always thinking positive and shit always happen for them, bro. And I'm a, bro, bro, I am not lying, bro. I asked them all the most high for everything, bro. And, and when I get it, I thank the most high. Like, you got to think about it. All this shit, look around in your room. All this shit you see, all this shit you bought, all this shit somebody else bought. You manifested that, my nigga. You manifested that. So, with that being said, if you manifested all of this shit, just think about you can manifest you a car. You can manifest you some more money. You can find that, uh, uh, manifest you a whole bunch of shit, my nigga. Like, they're just endless possibilities, bro. Like, if you spiritual, bro, everything starts in the spiritual realm first and then come to the physical world. You dig what I'm saying? So, once you started eating right and everything like that, 
and take care of your body working out, the spiritual realm sees that, right? So once you meditate and you manifest and saying you want stuff and you ask for a question, you will get that. You ask and you will receive. You dig what I'm saying? So once you're doing all that, everything will be happening much faster for you. You dig? But, um, yeah, man, y'all got to free y'all goddamn mind. Stop listening to what everybody tell you and going off of what they told you. Nigga, do your own fucking research, my nigga. How I many fucking times I got to tell y'all niggas that? Because these niggas, bro, these, these, this, this, these, these, these niggas demons out here, bro. These niggas demons, like, nigga, what the fuck? Hey, this, this shit, this, this shit get weird and wicked, bro. This word is wicked as fuck. I don't know why the fuck this microphone keep coming on. I have to keep tapping it. But, um, this shit getting weird and wicked as fuck, my nigga. So, it's like, I don't know. I don't fucking know. I don't know what the fuck finna happen. But I'm already prepared, my nigga. I got six cases of water right there. I got some canned food. I got some dry fruit, nigga, just in case some shit pop off. I don't fucking know. Like I said, y'all got to be prepared to uh, fast. Y'all got to be prepared to uh, 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 be with y'all selves, man. Y'all got to be prepared, bro. Y'all y'all think this shit a game, bro. Life is... Y'all think life sweet. This shit is not sweet. This shit is not a fucking game, bro. I can't stress this shit enough, bro. It's like, I don't, like I said, I don't fucking know. And y'all go might, y'all might hear me keep saying I don't know throughout these whole fucking videos that I be doing. It's just facts. Nigga, I'm focused on today. I don't know what's going to happen tomorrow. I know what happened yesterday, but I can acknowledge that. I can't live off of yesterday and, and make the same decisions I made today. No, fuck that, nigga. Today is a new day. I'm focusing on today. And how to uh, better my future for tomorrow. You did what I'm saying? Or, or the next five years. So focus on today. Focus on the now. Please, bro. Free your mind. Get off of social media. Stop watching this fake news. Stop watching what people telling you, nigga. Stop going off of what they tell you, nigga. Go off of what you know, nigga. Do your own fucking research. Free your fucking mind. I can't stretch that shit enough. Um, stock up on your water. Stock up on your food. Uh... If you're going to get on social media, unfollow all this toxic shit. You know what I'm saying? Follow all the positivity shit. You did what I'm saying? But then again, that shit could be a problem too because you you might get too happy with the positive shit and think you need that to be happy. You don't need shit to be happy. But I'm going to make that another video. So uh, I ain't even going to get too deep into that. But yeah, I think I covered everything in this video or whatever. You did what I'm saying? Uh, Let me see. Peace, love, prosperity, and always be great. And, and once you get saying, don't forget to thank the most high or your God or the universe. You know what I'm saying? Always be thankful for what you get and what you got. You dig what I'm saying? Najee Ra out. Peace.